Hey guys, so Shattered Family Portrait is my next story, written in script dialogue form. It's deep and personal to me. I really want this piece to reflect so much of who I am as a writer. I hope you appreciate it. So this is episode 16, Family Therapy Session. So this picks up from the last time we were with Pedro and Aaron at the art gallery. Pedro is helping his son with getting it together. After that, they both walk to the parking lot together. Pedro gets a phone call from his partner. Aaron wonders why he's calling him so late. Even Pedro is a bit confused. When he finally picks up, Bob tells him he needs to make it to his wife's house, ASAP, that it's really important. Pedro Worry tells his older son as they both get into his Jeep and rush through traffic. When they get to the house, there is Bob's car in the driveway a cop car, an ambulance, and even a fire truck from the city. Pedro immediately gets out of the car, thinking that maybe something really bad happened to his wife. Aaron got out of the car, took a few steps, and just watched. Bob was basically explaining to Pedro that he had received a dispatch from a radio saying a woman was hysterically crying, saying her younger son was trying to burn her in the house. From this story, Pedro knew where it was going. He just couldn't believe that it got to this point, because if they wanted, they could really commit her. As Pedro got closer, he saw his wife on the floor of the garage in her nightgown, telling the cop that her dead son, Spirit, was the one doing all of this. He had to re-say what she was saying because he couldn't believe it. Bob told the paramedics, cops, and fire department to leave, that this woman was just grieving over her dead son, and that's why she was being so irrational. I think one of the most intense scenes in this episode was when Aaron stood up and said that this is really her guilt playing with her. She kept nodding her head, refused to believe it, because she's still convincing herself that she did nothing wrong as a mother. As Pedro doesn't know what to believe, while Anthony is in the back taunting her, tricking her mind, also tricking the reader's mind, making us wonder if Anthony is really a ghost or a part of her imagination. The dispute ends where Aaron leaves and Pedro gives his wife up, getting her up, when Aaron leaves the situation, going back to his Jeep, he starts to have a flashback, one where he's taking his brother to a family session therapy with Pedro, Gigi, Anthony, and Aaron. This whole episode surrounds Dr. Clavett's session. I think it was very powerful because the purpose was to explain what's going on with Anthony when what ends up happening is World War III and everyone's throwing grenades in the room. Very chaotic, hectic, a lot of explosions, and no resolution. Stay tuned to see what happens next.